is a fan of ASOS. If you're a fan of ASOS, make sure you're like cuddled up, get a cup of tea, watch this video with me. You're gonna be getting some serious inspo. I'm gonna be giving you guys the honest truth. We've got a lot of night outfits. We've got some tracksuit bottoms. We've got some, obviously we've got a coat. We've got some bougie dresses. So let's just get started. All right guys, so the first item of course is gonna be this coat. Now, it's really, really cool. It comes with a belt. Um, I have to say, it's very, very lightweight. It's very puffy, like very, very oversized kind of vibes. What size did I get? I got a size, UK size six, and it's absolutely massive. And not just because of that, I think it's oversized. It comes with a waist belt, and it makes you look super cinched, but almost like cartoonish. I don't know if you guys get what I mean. I really do wanna keep this though, like it's just such a good massive piece that you can just really easily throw on. It's got giant arms. So yeah, definitely a keep for me. <laughs> Next item we're gonna go into is this purple dress. Now this is made from a kind of like denim material. It's got some structure, some sort of like plastic bits in the shoulder. I don't even know, I've never felt that before. Um, with a really cute tie waist. My problem with this dress, as cute as it is, is because it kind of has like a petal style skirt, it kind of like opens and it's very, very short. So if you've got long legs um, or if you just don't wanna be accidentally exposing yourself, I wouldn't recommend this dress. However, for like photos, for like a sit down meal, very, very cute, but like I wouldn't wear this like if I was going on a night out or like a day out because it's just too much of a risk, you know guys? Right. Next one. This, sis, this is a sassy dress. This is, I want to make every girl regret her outfit choice because this is such a good outfit. It's backless. The only thing I would say is because the backlessness is so wide, sometimes when it comes to that juncture between the armpit and like the side boob, it can get a bit risque. Um, so you might want to use some double-sided tape to make sure that it isn't opening and showing that side boob because we were trying to take photos earlier and it was a bit risky at some times. So had to kind of make some modifications, but otherwise really, really stunning. It's really nice and it's midi length, which I love. Next item. And as soon as I opened the bag, I was like, this is an Erin item. It's like a beige puff sleeve tiered wrap dress. Now I absolutely love this dress. My only qualm with it is, it was too big and all of these other pieces more or less fit me and I got them all in a size six to extra small but this one is just really really big so it made the waist a bit awkward you guys can see in the video like I've kind of had to wrap it round and that's not how the dress was designed to be made however if you want to go for like a loose baggy fit you definitely can do so and I will be keeping the shelf like this is stunning I love the fact that it's tiered I love the color of it I love the sleeves um, and it's quite a long dress so perfect if you're on holiday or just saving it for like spring summertime Right, next item, Oh, now this, guys, is from the Collusion Collection from ASOS. This is a saucy dress. This is when you wanna have like a power dress moment and you wanna stun and you wanna feel like a boss. This is the dress that you wear. So it's kind of like a wrap dress. It has buttons on the inside as well as a really, really long belt. I really like this belt. It's like so stupidly long and it kind of dangles down the middle. You know how that off-white belt is that everyone was wearing a while ago and it's just so long. I really, really like the fact that it has that kind of effect. It has shoulder pads which add to the drama. And what I like about shoulder pads, they make you have that like broad at the top, your waist will naturally go in and then that wide hip moment. So it gives a really, really good silhouette. Um, so I really, really like this one. All right, next item. Now this is a bit more of a Jimmy kind of like um, loungewear moment. It's like a zip up um, polo neck jacket. Really, really stretchy. It's that kind of seamless gym material. I really like it guys. I definitely will be keeping this. It's got some cute kind of like ribbed, what is this called? Maybe like foldy details on the shoulder. Um, this is definitely the one. I really like it. Next item, we're gonna move on to the tracksuits is these like velour, I don't know if you guys remember like Juicy Couture tracksuits, I couldn't afford it. So I used to get the Primark version. I thought no one could tell. Nobody's gonna know. They're gonna know. How would they know? No one could tell that I was wearing like a white velour thing and it said like, I had like a bird or something in Diamante on like the breast pocket area. It really wasn't cute. Like what was I doing wearing a white velour tracksuit? 
I don't know. These are really cool. These are very, very baggy. They're not slim fit, but they're very comfy. Nice thick waistband and very, very soft. And what's really nice is it comes with a matching top. I have to say, guys, when I put this top on, it was smaller than my bra. And I was like, damn, you know that this is a small top when it's smaller than your bra. So if you're not comfortable wearing a bra, without wearing a bra, you might wanna be a bit careful with this. But um, if you don't mind not wearing a bra, this is a really good alternative. It's kind of like a comfy sports bra. Personally, I don't think I'll be keeping this outfit just because you kind of have to wear it as one, one. And this was just a bit too like revealing for me. So next thing, oh, guys, right. So ASOS, they were like, okay, pick your items. Like we'll send it to you. And I got like some of my friends to help me pick the items. And this skirt, like I was suggested it by two different people. I wasn't automatically drawn to it because I was like, oh, uh, like I don't know how I'm gonna style it. I don't like wearing light or colorful things on my bottom half. If I'm not wearing like a dress or something like a two piece outfit, I like to, I like to wear black on the bottoms. So I was like looking at the khaki and I was like, nah, it's not really a bit of me. Um, it came and I was like, wow like this is one of my favorite pieces so guys this is a surprise win for me i'll definitely be keeping this one and what i would recommend pairing it with is this black shirt guys i've spoken about this before but i'm just not a shirt kind of girl i don't know what it is i think i have like broad shoulders or something but i just can't pull off a v-neck or a shirt or a button-up style this however is really really nice it has very nice like balloon sleeves and it just feels very quality like you can see that like bunching of material around that really really nice um, and the cool thing about it, and I'll show you how I styled it in the video, but you can do it like tie waist, which is similar to how I did the Primark video. Shout out to you guys who have seen that video. Now, next thing, guys, all I'm saying is you have to feel this. This is like the, I, I believe it's kind of like, what material is this? I don't even know. Just cozy. Again, my problem with this vest is it goes down really, really low. So I don't feel super comfortable wearing it. But the great thing about this is it comes, or I think you can purchase a matching cardi. Guys, when I say to you the quality of this cardi, oh my God, it's so heavy. The buttons, like you can see thought went into these buttons. There's not just like a random little flat circle one. This looks really, really good with that um, kind of like vest top matching, really nice color, very, very heavy. Um, and again, it has that like baggy sleeve, which I absolutely adore. Next item. Now this one I wasn't too sure about, but because I was going to Dubai, I was like, you know what, Erin, wear some bright colored clothing. This is like really nice and modest. I feel like this is a bit like, it's cute for Dubai. And I sis doesn't have like the biggest chest in the world, but I did feel like I couldn't move my arms that much. So if you do have like a flatter chest, or sorry, if you do have like a bigger chest, maybe, but like on a smaller frame, maybe be a bit careful when you're picking the sizing. But for me, this really did fit well, um, minus that like arm stretchiness. But honestly, when am I gonna go like this? Like when I'm wearing a dress like this? Really, really nice. Um, I love the flowiness. There's lots of layers underneath here. But I do think it's nice to have something like this for like family dinners. So, another piece that is also very, very cute, and I have to say, this is so Erin. So Erin. I love a good like peplum shift. It's not peplum, it's like a shift dress or like an A line dress. It's really, hello. It's really, really cool. The problem is, is like this is the type of dress that needs to be ironed. Sis hates ironing. But yeah, this definitely needs an iron when you use it. It's very, very lightweight, it's very floaty. Um, the collar is quite big, which I wasn't expecting, so it looks a bit, I don't know, like 70s-y. But um, other than that, minor, I'm definitely going to keep this. I really like it. Now, this item, I like, it came and it was just like a ball of purple, right? And I was like, what is this? How do you put it together? It took us a minute to work out. Um, but this is kind of like, I'm not going to keep this. It's very, very pretty. The neckline, I really, really like. I just don't think it's me and I don't think it's right for what I need in my wardrobe right now, given the fact that it's nearly December. Um, but it is very, very nice. I think maybe a bit more appropriate for someone a little, little older, perhaps. Um, but otherwise, really stunning, lightweight material and unique design. So if you're looking for something like a cute spring summer dress for next year, this is a really good option. All right, guys, we've got two items left. So the next one is very similar to a couple of the other items. I clearly was just like going for one type of thing, but it's like a purple wrap dress made of denim and it has a tie waist feature here. Again, it has the balloon sleeves, which is quite nice. Not balloon, but just wide sleeves. Um, it buttons all the way up, which is pretty cool. My problem is, is like, you know, when you um, 
do tie waist on denim and then the bottom half of it just gets a bit stiff. That kind of happened to this one, but of course that's the material, you can't avoid it. I just really like the pleating that it has right here as well as the color. I thought it was really, really unique. Um, so yeah, I really like this one. And last item, guys. Now it's quite funny, they sent me two of these by accident. One in extra small, one in double extra small. This is the extra small and I kept it. Um, it's really cool. Like you always need a big, big acid wash or dark colored jumper. You know, sis loves a funnel neck. Sis loves the kind of open hem at the bottom. I don't like it when jumpers kind of like curve inwards. I don't think it's flattering on me. I think you could style it, make it look really cool. When I wear it, it probably won't look very cool, but like, <laughs> I think if someone else cool wore it, it probably would look really, really cool. Um, and yeah, I really, really like this. So. That is it guys, thanks ASOS for sending me these. I know it was a bit late, but it was still worth it because a lot of these pieces are appropriate for winter. I hope you guys like my video. If you'd like me to do more like lookbook hauls, I would definitely be up for it. I love filming these. So yeah, thank you guys so much for giving me these opportunities as well. Like I wouldn't have opportunities like that if it wasn't for you watching right now. So make sure to like, comment and subscribe if you'd like to. Here is a virtual hug from me to you. Mwah! and I will catch you in my next video. For like photos um, and just like maybe sit down moments. Sorry, we just had a bang. No, I think we're fine. <laughs>